Hey guys, what's up? Sterling here and welcome back to my family guide back to the multiverse. Let's play. Last time we got through the first level, it's all Greek to me and now we are in this Amish level. Um, not too sure what the uh, name of this, alright, something's Amish. That's what the name of this level is. And it seems like Bertram is trying to get together an Amish group to kill us, so let's uh, go and stop him. <clears throat> alright, so let's go up here to... Uh, Collect something. Look, y'all gonna be able to see your enemies up close now. See what kind of skin tights they got and whatnot. All right, let's get these dicks. Crap, they're posting those pictures of us all over the place. And that picture is so not what I look like. We've got to stop them before anyone sees it. All right. All right, now remember what that little orange-haired brat said. These folks is building a weapon, so y'all need to find it. Okay, that was dumb. Come on, Stewie, they know we're here. <laughs> yeah, we might as well leave now. <laughs> hey, knock it off. Let's just see what these magic seeds can do for my tiny Amish dung. <laughs> All right, so let's kill some Amish assholes here. And now this is where the enemies get stronger, so we're gonna have to get uh, like some better weapons eventually. Yeah, this place does suck. All right, we get a wacky waving inflatable arm flailing too, man. So let's uh, launch it, and it distracts everyone. So far, yeah, let me just, oh wait, get away from that. <laughs> I accidentally hit the uh, R1 button um, when I look at the inventory. So yeah, so far we just have the sniper rifle. That's is our new weapon. Yeah, let's shoot that guy in the dick. <laughs> Alright, um, get back to Stewie. I think we just shoot that lock, right? Yeah. Objective, locate the barn. Yep, now we get a pretty useful uh, weapon, the flamethrower, and this is going to be very useful. It's definitely one of the best weapons. It makes things easier. Kill all the chickens. I don't want to kill chickens. <laughs> get this health pack right here we'll definitely need it let's just venture through the cornfield and burn some more Amish Oh shit, I forgot about those traps. The freaking bear traps or whatever those were. Gotta watch out for those. Oh yeah, and another thing I forgot, you can actually run by hitting the L3 button, like holding it down all the way. Like that, yeah. 
All right, burn the magic trees. Forgot what the magic trees look like. The beehive right there. Oh, another freaking bear trap. All right, so yeah, these trees, yeah, I remember now. I believe we just uh, do something. <laughs> oh yeah, we gotta take down these lights, I think. Alright, so that's one. Yeah, you have to destroy the lights of it. Let me get some health here. Burn all of ya. Alright, the next tree is over here. Get this health pack, that'll be pretty handy. Got a sun with glasses. <laughs> That's a little odd. Alright, there's the second tree. And let's get to the last one. Get out of here. Fry in hell, assholes. Alright. So now that the magic trees are gone, we gotta locate the Amish supply. Oh, yeah, and Bruce. That's the guy's name that's talking on the radio. The oh no guy. <laughs> Alright, get the fuck out of here, you fucking rapist. God. Trying to attack a baby, how could you? <laughs> I believe, yeah, all this needs to get burnt. If I remember correctly. Or probably not, I don't know. Let's collect all this money, though. Money, money, money. Oh, shit. Alright, get out. Move. Oh, right. <clears throat> oh, yeah, I remember there's one part in this that is a little tedious. You're like in kind of like a like a canyon part, if I remember correctly. And I think it's coming up. <laughs> Freaking Brian. Yeah, this is the part right here. It's kind of like a canyon mine car. I forgot. I think you have to, like, make a path or something. I don't know. It's been a while. Flood the quarry. That's what we got to do. Get some ammo. Yep, that's what you do. You have to turn the cranks. And the, yeah, the diamonds, like I said before, they're really helpful. They tell you where you know you need to go and everything. So 
This is for fun. I forgot what episode he says that, but Stewie does say that a lot in this game from what I remember. Oh shit, that was a not a good idea. That took out some of my health. And then the last uh, thingamabobber is up there. So we need to get back up there. Get some money, health. There we go. Alright, uh, there's a big bag of money right there. I'd like to get that. So I definitely want to take advantage of upgrading my ammunition and health. So, a couple bags of money. $100. $200. All right. And here's the last crank that we got to turn. And now, here comes some TNT. Now that that happened, we have to go over there, yeah. Try not to fall into the water. The water's a big no-no in this game. Okay. The freaking dialogue in this game. It's so funny. It's like, yeah, they they use, uh, you know, older, like, Family Guy voice clips, but then they make their own ones. You just couldn't keep your dirty hands out of my son's cornhole, could you? Now you must go. Oh, yeah, fight me, you tool. That's funny. <laughs> With our secret technology. Just kidding. Use your desert if you will. All right, so now, I think now would be a good time to use the uh, rifle. Or not the Malatov. It's fucking... And boom. Boom! I can't aim for shit. There we go. Shot him. Okay. Get back to Stewie. Walk around. And then let's fight the boss. Lord, forgive me for the whooping I'm about to bestow onto these two. Wait, why is this not count as technology? Alright, so for this boss, so that wooden, what's my dick, it is I like to use the sniper rifle. Wait, why does this not count as technology? At some safe distances. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, you want to shoot the eyes out from what I remember. Okay. Well, yeah, watch out for that shit. Oh, yeah, that's what you got to do. You just got to keep hitting the, the robot, and then when that guy comes out, you shoot him. Move. All right, let me just shoot the other eye. There we go. All right, 
So eyes, and then wait for the guy to come out. Fucking asshole, get out of here. Fuck, oh, that was a bad idea. Bad idea, I'm gonna die. Alright, he dead. He is dead. He gone, he dead. He's out of this world. The Amish are pretty amazing builders, aren't they? Oh my god, I was just thinking the same thing. I mean, Bertram was just here. These guys built a weaponized wooden robot in like 45 minutes. Pretty amazing stuff. Yeah, but I, I gotta imagine the women are... I mean, those bushes must be gigantic. Yep. <laughs> Alright, we're wasting time. Let's see where Bertram's off to next. Why y'all didn't visit the gift shop? They make their own preserves. <laughs> All right, so that is it for something's Amish. Not a bad level. Went by a lot faster than the um, the previous, the first level. So the next level, from what I remember, is actually a pretty good level, a pretty funny level as well. So let's um. Just watch the first cutscene for it when it comes up, and then I will end the part. The load times can be a bit slow in this game. That's probably the only problem I have with this game, other than that. It's a damn good game. Whoa, 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 what the hell is this? What? Brian Griffin checked into Amish Universe? Oh, yeah, so what? Well, first of all, we probably don't want Bertram knowing where we are all the time. And secondly, how do I put this? No one cares where you are. Well, I, I don't think that's true. Just, just don't do it anymore. Okay, now it says here that in this universe, handicapped people were given so much special treatment that they eventually took over as the leading power. If Bertram is recruiting an army, why would he go after handicapped people? I mean, couldn't we just kind of push them over? Oh, Peter just commented on your check-in. Interracial lesbian movie is free. You know, he just has no idea what he's doing online. All right, come on, let's find out what Bertram was doing here. All right, so yeah, um, in the next part we are going to be uh, we are going to be tackling uh, handicapped people, so uh, it's going to be pretty crazy in the next part. So I hope you guys enjoyed this part. Stay tuned for the next part. With that being said, I am Sterling, and I will see you guys later. Peace out.